Back at the airport, back at the airport after several months of not being here. So this is uh, Daughters 3. We are going to Mexico. Where are we going, gal? Cancun, again. Cancun town paradise. Yep, we're actually going to stay in Cancun for the first time ever. Hi. What do you think about what we're doing right now? Um, I'm trying to figure out what we're gonna eat for lunch <laughs> in Fort Lauderdale. Oh, Mexico, yeah. can we get some food around here? No kidding. All right, well that's about enough of that. Until next time. Okay, we have arrived at the resort. Casey's holding the spot in line. At least it's her turn to hold the spot in line to check in. There's a view of just like the lobby area. La Niñas! It's very windy. Very windy. What do you very think about windy. What do you think about the resort so far? Oh, oh let's look down here, just take a quick I peek. Yeah. yeah, this is a good look at the ocean with one of the pools. We're gonna have some fun. Until next time. Okay, we made it to our room. And this is the view here from just the front door. It's a nice little view of some ocean blue. The beautiful color only God can make, as Casey would patently say. But let's take a look at the room. All right, here we go. So let's just take a look and just a quick look at the bathroom. Not anything super special, just shower tub combo. And that's about it. Um, hola. Hola. Okay. So we have the ¿Cómo nice. Estás? There's como estás. Nice open area with the master bed, and then here is the bunk situation. I don't know how to open this. <laughs> See, barely gonna be. Somebody's gonna be able to trundle, pull out dudes here. And there's bunk situation, and there's Casey. We do have a balcony. Oh I won't. I won't go what out there. There's the view of the pool and the ocean right there at our beck and call. Quaint little beach-ish bar there. That level right there, that's where the main pools are, right up there. And then there's the stretch. And then yes, those are the water slides. That's where we came to find, make sure that, you know, they didn't disappear. Um, the girls will be spending time there for sure. Hola! We are off to our first dinner um, at La Piazza. Is that what it's Piazza. called? La Piazza. And um, we are, it's Italian. Uh, there is a big board over here that has every day's activities. Seems like a lot. Yeah, that's just today's activity. That's just today's. Yeah, I, I want to know where the fitness club is, so when I go this week, try to work out at least once and not ruin also, my routine. To to the beach. I want to maybe check out the fitness club, because I'm in the club. club. The club. In the club. Okay. Anyway. Um, See you until next time. Until next time, Joel wants me to say. So, still first evening. We are in a really cool like lobby area here and there's a game room I'll show you right here in just a moment. Um, there's a bar over here and then right behind me, right there, is a view of the pool and the ocean. And then what you do is you walk through, you know, right over here and here I'll just show you. just the half of it. We are at the beach. It's a beautiful, beautiful, warm, sunny, breezy day. The seaweed missed me. It missed me so much since last year that it decided to come back and say hi to us and brought a lot of its friends with it. Uh, but it's gorgeous out there. Look at this. There's Gallia having fun in the sun. Not too far, G. bar 
me. And then I'm gonna show you what the rest of the fam is up to. Let's go take a look. What are you doing? Can I swimming. teach you how to, how to swim? You're at yeah. the pool. First time at the pool. <laughs> You're learning how to swim. Bye, Everybody say hola. 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 Water. Yes. You're more like water. Yes. There she is. Hi. You know, it's Mother's Day in Mexico today. They might do it on the same day every year, so today it's on Wednesday. But oh, like, we do it like on, we'll a, Sunday, it on a Sunday. But they do it on a, the like May 10th yeah. or whatever it is. They gave me a rose this morning. Yes. So I have a rose back at the house, back at the room. By any other name, would it smell as sweet? Uh, yes. Okay. Yeah. Just double checking. Yeah. Um, the mojitos are good. And um, the sunshine is that good too? It's a lovely, lovely day. The sunshine's amazing. The view is gorgeous. Do you see the view out here? I, sh I, right yeah, there. I, sh I showed you guys right the view there. already. The view is amazing. And um, I couldn't be happier with my whole family. Yep. All right, this video is run its course. So until next time. Hola. It's wet, so it's dripping on my head. Um, what's your favorite part of this vacation? Breakfast. Breakfast? Yeah. Good answer. Galia, huh? favorite part of your vacation so far? Last year I said the trip. Um, I like food. Food. <laughs> Adoree just said breakfast too. Help your sister. Help your sister. Caroline, <laughs> what's your favorite part of the trip so far? <laughs> Ooh, I know. What? I know. What? Sleeping with my sisters. Oh, and my least favorite thing? The plane. The plane. The plane. What's your favorite part? The best part about getting shot in the buttocks is all the ice cream. I like the coconut ice cream. That's your favorite part? No, I just wanted to say that. Uh, my favorite part is probably laying on the beach chair by the beach. Because you, you're right there by the beach or by the water on the beach. You feel the ocean air and the breeze and the sun, if you want the sun or the shade. Um, it's very serene, so yeah. I will second that. Um, my favorite part has been the beach so far as well. But the food is good. It's good, it's good. There's, there's a couple things that haven't been our favorite, but overall, food's good. The, this pool's nice. The other one's a little adult for a family resort, I believe. And um, the views are spectacular here. So, just again, just to show you. This is what we're looking at. All right, till next time. Look what I got. Show me what you got, honey. I got a churro, a, some kind of coconut something. A cream puff, and then I don't remember what Something else that was fried and delicious. Ooh, got it. Lime. Ooh. Ooh. What'd you get? Lime ice cream as well? So let's I'll try it. Alright. Well it's time for dessert. The dinner was absolutely sensational. The food here has been sensational. And now it's time for a sensational dessert.
and we get Onboard Entertainment. Onboard. Let's check it out. Hola. 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 Where are we? We are at the La Isla. La Isla. La Isla. La Isla. La Isla. 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 Shopping Isla. Center. La Isla. Watch our video. She joined in. You mean like and subscribe, like and, subscribe and share? Like and subscribe! Let's take a look. So we just came from that way. And right now we're going this way. Just kind of an open air. So you just have these sun coverings. So it's not too bad in here, heat wise. And then there's these cute little avenues back and forth. And yeah. Oh, and a fountain. How about that? Right in front of me. What'd you get? What'd you get? Say it right. It's a tortuga. 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 Keychain. Oh, there it is. It's got bling, bling. Little bling bling. Bling bling. My. Adore. Are you sunstruck from yesterday? Yeah. What are you, are you eating beef jerky? You feel better about it? I'm here. I get a tortuga. All right. Barely. 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 Hi. Hi. You have fun? Yay. Okay. <laughs> All right. Somebody say until next time. Until, until next, next time. time. Hola. We are back at the pool, back at the pool. And we're at this area um, that's called the covered pool. It's nice because we need a little reprieve from the sun. We've been in the sun a lot and um, we got some new season sunburns. So um, yeah, we, <laughs> We are taking a reprieve, which is really nice in this covered pool area. There's still some sunshine coming through, but it's diffused, so it's not as bad. And now we're doing some kind of a train in the pool. And there's Barely and Galia and Joel and Adderay. And they are entering this covered pool. So over there is the lobby, and our room is down underneath those steps over there that you can see. We're looking forward to trying the steakhouse at some point. Barely, where are we? Beside the wind tunnel. Ah, the bazaar. The bazaar. Remember, we, we have one of these. We got one of these with palm trees, I believe. No touchy, no touchy. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Here, come here, look. Look at all these leatherworks. Pretty little girl bags. I used to know how to play that game, okay. This guy later, earlier. Mommy took video of that guy. Okay. Look, remember this? Yeah. Okay, we're at the bazaar, killing time before dinner at the Fisherman Seafood Restaurant thing. Honey, where are we at? I don't know, but I just got a gluten-free little tray of goodness here. Oh my goodness. You know where we are. We're at Fisherman's. Fisherman's. We're at Fisherman's. Here you go, babe. What are we yeah. having for dinner tonight? Yumminess. Yumminess. Delicioso. Yeah? Fish Red and fish. steak. Fish, fish, fish. Steak. Matequilla? Fish. Fish. Yeah. Yummy. Okay. I'm so happy they're gluten free. I wonder if the other places are gluten free. No one else asked me. They actually really, asked me here. I really think that we should be asking about it. Yeah, I'm impressed. Yes. Mm. Oh, when I open it, I saw yellow on it. We are excited to be here tonight. We've had a lovely, relaxing day. Now. We stayed out of the sun on purpose. On purpose. Are you ready to Sunstruck. <laughs> He needs to take our order. Gustavo needs so. to take our order now. <laughs> we cannot Gustavo, leave Gustavo uh, waiting. Uh -huh. 
Hi guys. Uh, all the kids with the wings and everything. Back at back at the buffet. Back at the buffet. Yay! You're recording, aren't you? Um, no. I'm recording. Hi. No one knows. Hola. This is our third full day. And I just sat in our room for 15 minutes trying to make dinner reservations. There were a lot of people online checking in yesterday, so I think the resort is more busy, but the fact that we have to make a reservation every day instead of making them for the whole week is a little tiring because I shouldn't have to sit in my room waiting to get through on the line. So that is one definite negative. We just ate dinner. That's not true. We just had dinner at the Italian buffet where we really like this place because the service is really, really good. It's really windy. And the food here. is really, really good. Very windy. Oh my and gosh. you can't see it, but that's an ocean. That Maybe you can see it, but there's an ocean back there. And it's beautiful. Very house. beautiful. Beautiful view. These beautiful are two little house. monkeys. You just bent that bar. Look at her. She's so strong. <laughs> you really bent that bar right there. Man, there's something in the tiramisu around here. Let me tell you. <laughs> All right, we're probably gonna go get some footage of Michael Jackson. kids off at the kids club. There's movie in there, there's water slides, a mini basketball court, a little splash pool. It's for kids like, <laughs> is it 4 to 12? Is four, that what they four say? 4 to 12. 4 to I 12. I believe, yeah. We're kidless. We're kidless. For just a little while, they're at for the kids while. club. So we're at the pool, pretending what it's like to be on vacation without kids. Which we will be. So we're practicing, we're doing a, we're doing a dress rehearsal for vacation without Nino, Nina. Which we will be later this year. In Aruba. But for now, para ahora, we're at the Crown Paradise Hotel. But I want to mention the kids club and how fantastic it is. It's this huge like water park kind of area. And um, it's, I mean, it's more geared towards younger kids. But um, those middle-aged kids, like around nine to to 11 or probably like they they'll probably be fine there the 12 year olds get a little annoyed it's a really neat area and then we got to get ready for listen pilgrim john wayne's boots for dinner pilgrim say pilgrim pilgrim <laughs> i think he said pilgrim a lot i don't know i don't know what do you think i have no idea all right until next until time. next time <laughs> hello so that is where we're having dinner tonight at Wayne's Boots. But right now, we are on a mini golf course. Did you go yet? I did. I beat you in this last hole. Is that a challenge? No. Challenge accepted. Oh, there goes mommy's ball. 
It's actually really nice here because most of the putt-putt course is under the shade of these beautiful palm trees. Yeah, beautiful shady um, little mini golf course. It's actually in pretty good shape. We've been to resorts with very, very terrible, terribly made putt-putt layouts. Uh, this one's actually pretty good. So it's like I'm on a date in like 1997. And Hola. What have you? Lemon pie. Where are we? Wayne's Boots. What did you have for dinner? Chicken. Grilled chicken mm -hmm. with mashed or with a baked potato? Yes. Cool. What did you have for dinner? Chicken nuggets and fries. And a Caesar salad? Mm-hmm. Turbo nuggets and fries and now I got um, a lime pie. A lemon pie? Mommy, what yes. do you have there? I have a lemon pie. No? I had steak, a ribeye. It's okay. And There's good parts and bad. Good parts and bad. And then I had a baked potato and I had a grilled vegetable salad. It was that was pretty good. And oh the creamed corn soup. So so delicious. Ooh. And I had the exact same thing as mommy. Uh, other than the cream corn soup, but we got the exact same thing for dinner. My steak was a little better than hers. Um, it was okay for an all-inclusive. You don't expect a whole lot from a steak, uh, but it was. I, I I ate it. It was decent. Mechanical bowl. It's not working right now, but this kid is all over it. But we're probably gonna go see a fantasy variety Disney show tonight at the theater. Uh, but between now and then, we'll march around and enjoy the evening. So. Until next time. Which is the point, the, the what is this the most tip, southern, uh, tip. southern tip of Isla Mujeres? So let's take a look at this beautiful view. Have fun? Yes. What's your favorite part about Isla Mujeres? The views. Golf cart cruising views. <laughs> All right. So this area here, you actually have to pay six dollars per person, including kids. So that would be thirty bucks. Uh, we decided not to do it because we paid a lot of money to get here and to pay the golf cart. But yeah, there's just all these little like statues and then there's this main lookout area over there with what looks to be some sort of Mayan ruin. But that is so beautiful, the big rocky cliff looking stuff here. I love it. We are going to probably take a picture over by this Isla Mujeri sign which does not cost money. And then probably get back in the golf cart and go to the northern tip of the island. So this is where we're eating lunch on Isla Mujeres. Uh, I have no idea what this place is called. It just says Mexican and seafood restaurant. So maybe it's called the Mexican and seafood restaurant. And we just ordered and I'm doing a quick video just to check out the sights and sounds of it all. It's right by the water. Uh, so you have some catamarans and boats and yeah, nice little loungy area here. We're getting nachos. And quesadillas. Nachos and quesadillas, and I got a burger because I'm um, having Mexican quesadilla. tonight. Um, yeah, there's a gift shop right here. There's a East Luma Harris sign right there. We're going, going, going to get a picture of or with here in a minute. But yeah, this is this is our view from lunch. So this is the opposite of where we were at. Hi, gal. Hey. Because you can come all the way out here and like it's hardly any waves coming in. There's these little weak sauce waves here. 
but we're like knee deep and we're that far from the shore. Honey, <laughs> now this is more like it. Yes, this is amazing. Uh, but this is just spectacular. Fun in El Sol. Isla Mujeres. It's Mother's Day. Mother's Day. This is her Mother's Day present. I already said that earlier. Well, we're gonna enjoy ourselves here for a little while and then head back to return our cart rental and then get on the ferry and head back for dinner at our resort. So until next time. It's the last full day and we are at the pool. We had a nice breakfast with our number one primero server, Eduardo. He's been fantastic. We go to the same breakfast place every day uh, of the two choices because we get great service from him. Where are you going? Uh, get the sun. Oh, good idea. Barely, what are you doing? I'm cold. What, are you cold? You're out here, it's 85 degrees and it's in Mexico. I just got out of the pool. Okay, well hopefully you dry off and get warm again. Henry, what are you doing? Swimming. Are you having fun? Yeah. Awesome sauce. Are you sad that it's the last full day? Yeah. Galia, are you sad that it's the last full day? Yeah, but I want to go home and see Isla. You want to see Isla? Yeah. And Getty and Riviera and Jasmine. Watch the Isla video, the one, the one that says breaking news. Isla? Breaking news. That's what I said. I said, I know. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe, dude. Yes. <laughs> Any more final comments for the pool uh, you know, last full day? It's been a lovely week. The weather has been phenomenal. It was a little windy, but it's been really a great week. And the service here is really good. And the food here is really good. There's a couple things that aren't great, but I mean, that's that comes with the territory, right? So it's been a pretty great week. Yep. Great way to spend seven days. Yep. This is the last lunch on our trip. And this is the ice cream duo here. What'd you get? Lime, Lime ice, ice cream. cream. Lime sorbet. Do you deserve it? Yes. Uh-uh. Yes. Hola! We are at dinner for the very last time um, on the sixth day, is that correct? Yes, wait, we leave tomorrow morning and so we'll have a breakfast one more time. So, here's Galia, oh, Adoree, and Barely, where are you? She's hiding, okay, ah, there she is. Okay, so anyway, I wanted to talk about where we are. We are in the Italian buffet restaurant. La Piazza. We have literally eaten here um, three dinners and three breakfasts. Four. Four breakfasts. Yeah. Um, we keep coming back here for breakfast because we love the lattes. The lattes are so delicious here. And we really love Eduardo. And we love Eduardo. Eduardo, if you come to the Italian restaurant here, then you have to ask for Eduardo. He is the best. Anyway. If you do come, tell us what you think in the comments. Yes. Below. Ding. Yeah, you got anything to add? No. Uh, what did you think about your pinata? It was so good. My, it was? My virgin pina colada. They call it a pinata here. Yeah. Pinata, it's a mocktail. Yes. And Adore? What did you think about everything? Yeah? Barely? Did you have a piñata this week? I think I did one. She had one. How was it? I had a half one. It was good. Really good? Yeah. This is my third time, I think. <laughs> I have nothing to add but well wishes and love to you all. <laughs> Final thoughts before we do video post Final thoughts. Resort. Um, yeah, I mean, it's just sad to leave. It's been a week, but um, man, I don't want to go. <laughs> yep. Seven nights is a is a good trip. It, it really felt like we were able to settle in. Yeah. So we've done five nights before in other places, and uh, it felt like a little bit of a quick turnaround. But 
you know, seven nights is a good chunk of time. So check, this was check your some flight R &R. prices. And if your flight prices are higher, then stay the extra day at the resort. That's what we did. It, Basically, it the money about, you save in the flight, you can use for one more night in the hotel. Yep. The resort. Make sure you're so. checking those flight prices. Oh yes. Okay. But anyway, Off we go. until next time.